To use the large format printer, first set up the media. Go behind the machine and move the media stays and media holders to fit your media. Carefully put the media on the media holders. Take the end of the media and slide it through the thin slit of the machine. The media should be over the roll, not coming from underneath. See smaller media as it fits through the slit. Press the lever down to hold the media in place. Lift the lever in the front. With 54 inch media, move the pinch rollers so they each line up with the grit roller, which is marked by a blue dash. On smaller media, line up a pinch roller with every other blue mark for grit rollers. The two end pinch rollers should always be on the ends of the media. If not, the media will not be measured correctly. Refer to the image with the printer to double check the pinch rollers as this is extremely important to have correct. Place the media clamps on the outside of the media. Close the door and make sure the front lever is down. On the printer screen, press Setup. Choose your media from the list. Press Next. Keep the Do Not Use Take Up unit and then press Start Setup. The printer will measure the media. You are now ready to print. Go to the computer and click on the VersaWorks software. In the top left corner, click File and then Add to QA. Find your file on your USB drive and click on it. Then click Open. Your file will show up in the queue. Double click on your job in the queue. This opens job settings. Click Get Media With to get the size of the media from the printer. Click the box next to Center on Media to evenly use the space. For stickers, increase the copies to make a whole row of stickers. Always print a full row to not waste media. Change the spacing to fit more on a row. Then click Quality Settings and choose the media type. Click OK. When printing stickers, make sure the software recognizes your cut line. Under Special Items, there should be an A with a square around it for cut contour. There should be a gray line in the preview screen, and in the Job Settings window, there should be magenta lines. Click the Print icon. The printer can only print 250 copies at a time, so to keep more than 250, change the amount of copies. Otherwise, press Print. The job will be loaded to the printer and it will print. If there are cut lines present, it will cut. To remove your print, press Sheet Cutting on the screen. Choose Sheet Cutting, then press Execute. The printer will cut the media and then push it forward for you to take. You can cancel setup by pressing Cancel Setup, then press Yes. Lift the front lever to remove pressure on the media. Delete your job from the printer. If making stickers, cut away excess media. Then pull away the top layer, leaving only the stickers behind. You can now cut each sticker apart, and they are done.